Dear viewers, uh, welcome you all to our show, OSA, Automatic Solution Academy. I hope you all are well during this COVID-19 pandemic situation by wearing masks and keeping distance with each other. Dear viewers, today our topic is uh, the cosmetic Elizaro. That is a fantastic topic. Uh, by using this magical Elizaro, uh, we can uh, do the stature lengthening. And our speaker is uh, Professor Navikov, sir, uh, from uh, Russian Institute of Elizaro, Kurgan, Russia. And we have uh, two academic experts, uh, Professor Mofakharul Barisar, the pioneer Elizaro surgeon in Bangladesh, and definitely Dr. Shamsul Huda, sir, uh, from Patna, India. Uh, I would like to welcome all of them to uh, join with us. And I would like to uh, request uh, Professor Navikam sir uh, to start his presentation regarding the uh, cosmetic Elizabeth, the stature lengthening. Uh, Professor Navikam sir, would you please uh, start your fantastic presentation? Thank you very much for your invitation. Thank you for possibilities a uh, little bit share with our experience. Uh, this is, uh, you're absolutely right, uh, interesting topic. And uh, like any methods of treatment, he has some interesting page. Uh, in, let me start from our father, our genius, Professor Elizarov. Uh, this year we will celebrate 100 years since uh, his birth. 70 years of uh, his baby, Elizarov apparatus and methods, and uh, 50 years of our center, biggest orthopedic center in the world, in small village, in small town. And uh, in the history of the world, people of low structure have extended at all the time. And uh, so many variants uh, of treatment for increased height. All of doctors from all of the world try, but cannot really support for these people. And uh, cosmetic lengthening, I won't start from dwarfism because uh, all of uh, this knowledge, all of these skills, all of this technique coming from uh, methods of uh, support for patients with achondroplasia. On this slide, so many great surgeons give us uh, information about everything of body with achondroplasia, but only few person give us knowledge about orthopedic treatment, orthopedic support. Before Elizarov, we can help only with correction deformity, nothing more. Uh, uh, was only uh, social support. And Elizarov was first and uh, I was uh, first uh, chief of department, this uh, unique uh, department. On 5th of uh, September, 1983, Lizarov opened it, the world's first department of growth regulation. And uh, from all of the world, from Italy, Bulgaria, Spain, Cuba, Iceland, Poland, France, Saudi Arabia, Iran, Egypt, patient, and so many countries come for treatment. And uh, here you can see uh, some aspects. When we start treatment, you can see severe valgus on, uh, this is my patient uh, from uh, Italy says Samarka, just now uh, he is president, uh, biggest of uh, association of short people in the world, ISAC. And Elizarov start support with lengthening. And uh, now more than 1,000 patients with achondroplasia have been treated in our center. And we solve problems like 
defect of damage of B mechanics. This is number one. Then aesthetic needs and some social, domestic and psychological problems. And this is depend uh, when patient come for us. This is baby, five, six years old, or this is adult, seven, or, uh, 35, 40 years. And uh, we take into account such aspects of medical and social rehabilitation as biomechanical, ergonomic, aesthetic, and where ergonomic problems of the patient with shortening of limb segments occur. This is uh, personal computer operating, diving the car, sports, physical activity, everyday activities. And what we need to improve. This is easy access to control and directing system, easy access to overview and control of detecting system, easy access to security system. And remember this picture, very strange and very, very important. Because this is estimation of bone tissue destruction potential. Usually we uh, see only X-ray and don't think about what is it X-ray. A round of this picture. And we use uh, like radiography, ultrasound, digital bone density analysis, evaluation of distraction potential of soft tissue, soft tissue ultrasound, AMG, measuring of absolutely and relative volume of the extended segment and evaluation of patient rehabilitation cap capacity, control of range of motion in adjustment joint, exercise therapy, soft tissue, ultrasound, muscles, AMG. Remember this picture. And Elizarov uh, start to lens, touch uh, first tibia on the one level, but having time because so many uh, patients wait uh, his support and the next step was uh, bifocal lengthening. If we touch uh, simultaneous two tibias, uh, on the next uh, the stage we need to touch femur, one femur, another femur. This is two stage to the femur. Yulizarov uh, try in one uh, stage lens unilateral femur and uh, tibia but uh, for me this is not so good uh, variant because uh, very bit uh, big uh, tension near the knee joint and after this treatment knee joint never back to the normal life then come in another unique uh, variant simultaneous lengthening contralateral tibia and femur. And now, usually, all of patient go through this technique. Uh, yeah, uh, I already show this uh, picture. This is like uh, historical. Patient from Hungary, another patient from Hungary, very difficult uh, simultaneous lengthening of uh, two uh, femur. Another guy from Russia, patient from Iceland, patient from Ukraine. Heavy time. And please not follow this way. Only calculate how many fractures. One, two, three, four, five, six. Too much for one patient. This is patient from Poland. All patient is satisfied, but this experience give us knowledge. And just now, uh, my recommendation: go for support step by step. One segment, then another segment. Take rest, 
and like that. And when we have enough experience, same time, near 40 years ago, Oh, very good picture. This is Sessa Marca from Italy. This is Algieri from Italy. Kamal Hosni. Gaucher from France. Novikov. Dror Paley from India. Oh, I rem uh, support. I forgot this, his name. And all of this uh, doctor use external fixator and association of uh, patient of visachondroplasia invite us uh, for his uh, conference. And uh, Jacques Caton, this is slide from him I took, uh, explain of uh, his experience. And yeah, uh, we can support with increase of height, only patient with medicine, <coughs> medicine problem. And he never touch a patient uh, without uh, medicine uh, deformity or shortening or discrepancy. And uh, he all time says, uh, never touch cosmetic patient because we don't know how we will finish of this treatment. And Many years ago, this is data when first time in the world Elizarov touch healthy person. This is uh, Paola Magherini from Italy, and uh, I was doctor. Uh, Elizarov was a surgeon of this guy. We uh, finished lengthening after 14 centimeters. Patient very uh, heavy treatment, eight uh, osteotomies. Uh, I uh, can say this is terrible treatment because uh, double speed, one millimeters for each level, upper side, lower side, and eight fracture each day, four times. This is heavy treatment. Now in the world, we have so many different uh, techniques, including uh, intramedular technique for lengthening, uh, some uh, our <coughs> external fixator. But I prefer Elizarov methods because you know this is almost blood less than low intensive surgery. Colleagues, did you hear me? Colleagues, yes, so we can hear you, sir. Please continue, yeah. sir. Yeah, and uh, this gives us uh, possibilities uh, during the treatment anytime correct some problems and go away from this problem. And uh, when we touch cosmetic person, cosmetic uh, patient, we need to think about golden relation, golden proportion, because a little bit later I will show what is it golden section of Leonardo. And here you can see the section and formula when we calculate how many amount of our lengthening. But some patient not satisfied with that because uh, for proportional very short uh, amount we need. Just now example of lengthening. For example. If initial heights before treatment was uh, 150 centimeters, and we very easy can calculate 
this is number 1.5 but for gold section we need 1.62 then we can calculate how many centimeters we need lens his tibia for our gold here I want to show some proportional uh, results. Before treatment, uh, her height was 168, after 172. But a uh, patient won before uh, surgery 10 centimeters. When we calculate her span, her win was 172. And uh, he follow me. Uh, I motivate her uh, only for five centimeters. And patient just now on the inside of gold uh, section of Leonardo. Another guy from Australia. He come and uh, he has uh, the idea I want maximum. And I was crazy doctor because I follow his. Uh, plan. I am not stop him. Just now, uh, 15 years ago, I was satisfied because uh, near 14, 13.5 uh, uh, centimeters, we increase uh, his height. Before treatment, he was uh, 159. After treatment, 172. And patient happy. 15 years ago, I was happy. Today, I'm unhappy. Why? Because I not improve his life. For jump, for moving, for car, for commode. This is amount on lengthening this part for everything. Stupid idea, little bit stupid data, and stupid result. Remember this picture and not follow. We can finish lengthening only with medicine propose, medicine uh, calculation. And if we can back proportional for all of part of body, this is disproportional result. This is, I can say, this is complication. But patient haven't any comp orthopedic complication, but this is complication. And you can see proportional result from Russia, same data, but disproportional result not so good. This is bad result. And Sometimes when doctor show his result, oh, I know won't, but patient won't, I can say, patient buy doctor. This is bad money. Not for, uh, take uh, this example and not follow this example. And usually uh, when we touch uh, cosmetic patient, uh, it's more than enough, one level. Or five, six, till eight centimeters. If you will uh, lengthen it very slowly, because uh, many years ago uh, we request uh, till five centimeters, one level. Uh, if uh, you want to increase height or patient need to increase height uh, for eight, ten centimeters, must two level. Two level more heavy and soft tissue. Uh, not tolerate this speed of lengthening two millimeters uh, for each day impossible for adult patient please remember and usually all of patient with any problem after surgery satisfied why because from one level from one floor for example here 160 after treatment, little bit, but he is higher than 170. And patient happy, more than happy.
But remember about function of all of joints, biomechanical issue. And during this uh, treatment, uh, many years we try find some support. What will be uh, to do short period of uh, healing, including uh, wire with uh, hydroxyapatitis, uh, which we put in intramedullary. My experience, nothing helped. This is like pregnant. Time for healing is time for healing. If you will uh, to do short, I think this is will not uh, result from God time. This is my experience. Maybe uh, I am wrong. Maybe this is my mistakes. But just now, for my patient, I never use. For me, bond mirror. This is holy cow. I no want touch and disturb uh, mother of future born. And all of these patient, not uh, too short period of treatment with any stimulation. And <clears throat> any our uh, activities with a cosmetic surgeon, please remember first, do no harm. Premium nil nursery, because sometimes like this is pretty girl come for three centimeters for lengthening and everything finished with very bad result with osteomyelitis with subluxation both of feet with severe scars all part of uh, where was wire and then patient spent this is patient not my patient this is patient from ukraine from good doctor but you can see which kind of result uh, this is uh, another way when patient lost life according of this procedure why because doctor and patient think only about amount of lengthening not about function of joint not about position of foot all period of treatment patient stay in the bed never walk this is not elizarov methods this is not elizarov frame i don't know what is it but patient thinks this is elizarov methods because if patient cannot touch flow if patient haven't 90 position of uh, uh, 90 degree position of foot, uh, Elizarov immediately stop of this procedure. If patient can touch, if patient can move here, if patient cannot unbend knee joint, we can continue. If no, we not just now follow uh, idea of patient. I need five, six doesn't matter how centimeters patient need. We need to think about future. We need to think about improvement on, of life because centimeters not give improvement of life. Uh, then when we uh, not follow principle of Elizarov, I can say this is already a mistake and complications will come because so many time Elizarov methods this is not same of apparatus of Elizarov because uh, sometimes Elizarov methods this is hip support Elizarov methods this is sometimes monolateral doesn't matter which kind of uh, frame uh, Eo or Hoffman or Wagner and in other way sometimes uh, apparatus of Elizarov this is not same of method of Elizarov because uh, with uh, Elizarov frame patient not walk, patient not move of joint, and uh, system of this apparatus having hinge and doctor cannot correct uh, some small deformity and ideal situation when 
ductor use appar uh, apparatus of Elizarov, and this is equal same of methods of Elizarov, and result will magic and in other way this is must very good communicate doctor and patient if patient follow instruction of doctor we have magic fantastic result during the treatment you can see joint is good position of foot is good uh, patient have in other activities and result will excellent and we not simulate because uh, for healing uh, any body need minimum two and a half three months and we spent all of these months uh, all of this time for excellent healing and all of this bad experience heavy dark experience just now give us uh, knowledge give us understanding for this period for this concept of treatment cosmetic patient now i will little bit explain we uh, during the treatment same amount of lengthening uh, many years uh, take different results and we start seeing why because one patient five centimeters another patient five centimeters but result is absolutely different one patient after two months uh, of fixation back to the normal life another patient after 10 months of fixation cannot uh, back to the normal life and we uh, to analyze treatment result of various amount of lengthening. Why? Because amount makes different according to the percentage increase in bone length. For example, what is five centimeters for different initial size? If you will take uh, five centimeters for tibia, thirty-five centimeters size. This is less than fourteen percent of initial side. Same amount if tibia thirty centimeters size. Five centimeters of lengthening is more than 15 percent of initial size and for example for short person five centimeters lengthening for 25 centimeters initial size this is more than 20 percent of initial size same amount of lengthening different percentage from initial site of, uh, of tibia and uh, when we uh, to analyze some uh, big group more than uh, 70 uh, patients uh, all of this patient uh, was uh, less than uh, 170 centimeters and uh, all of uh, patient was so young and we treat only with Elizarov methods with our osteosynthesis and we delayed for uh, all of this uh, group to the three group first group was lengthening amount up to 15 percent of initial segments length second group was the lengthening amount from 15 to 20 and the third group the lengthening exceeded 20 percent of initial length what is it and what is it percentage 15 20 more than 20. according of uh, classifications uh, drawer paley problem obstacles complications and i am agree with this because 
uh, during the treatment so many problems and obstacles but, but only uh, complications influence on the uh, final result and when dis distribute uh, to amount of uh, all of these groups depending of the amount of lengthening on the first group amount was not so big only uh, for medical reason we increase for proportional treatment up to 15% uh, of initial uh, size. Second group, this is uh, lengthening was more than 6 cm. And third group, more than 20%, more than 8, uh, more than eight cm. And you can see, what is it? Small amount or good result? What, when uh, come patient uh, before treatment and patient want, I want maximum. I'm all time show this picture. What you want? You want good or you want big amount of lengthening? This is absolutely different point and impossible get good result with big uh, amount of lengthening. Patient want good result. And you see, on the first group, we haven't uh, complications, very small amount in the third group we have 20 percent patient has some complications because because our lengthening was more than 20 percent of initial size this is our uh, evaluation table we calculate range motion of uh, joint, knee joint, ankle joint, has patient deformity on heaven, and then we delayed uh, all of result like excellent, good, satisfactory, and poor. And you can see, all patient has some results, and we not understand what is it. This is all patient. But when we delayed uh, to the group, first group has only excellent and good result. And you can see third group, half patient has satisfactory and good result. And only 20% has excellent result. This is depend how many centimeters we did and you see just now i won't show absolutely same amount of lengthening eight centimeters this is guy from pakistan but citizen on the england we finished our treatment with eight centimeters this is up to 15 and his result was near excellent good position of foot, excellent position of function. Uh, we haven't any uh, neurological pro problem. Muscles is good. Another Russian woman, and uh, for her height, and uh, same amount of lengthening, she uh, inside of uh, second group, from 15 to 20, and result was not excellent, only good. And this is guy from Japan, from third group, our 20% of initial size. And we get, we get result, but so many times we go to the operation theater. Uh, we spend so big time for contracture of knee, uh, joint and uh, equinus deformity of foot. But patient is good. But I am prefer first group. Uh, this is patient from third group. And on the conclusion, we can say, if we length up to 15% of the initial length, we, haven't, we have only prob uh, problems and obstacles. And 
no effect on the final outcome. At the same time, when the limbs was lengthened for more than 20 percent of initial size, the problems and obstacles often transformate into complications and reduce the quality of the final outcome. And I won't repeat again our magic method, almost bloodless surgery, very strong fixation of bone fragments, early weight bearing on the affected limb, function of the adjustment joint, and post-operative adjustment joint bone fragments we can manage from the surgery time till the removal of the frame. And most important, as this is good rapport and understanding between the doctor and patient. I'm already show this and same like covering patient, she won't before surgery 10 centimeters. When we measure her maximum five on the final perfect result, proportional result. This is good communication between doctor when patient follow experience and knowledge of doctor. If doctor follow interest of patient, sometimes crazy idea, this result will not so good. We published our experience in the clinical orthopedic and related research and uh, some articles we have on the limb lengthening reconstruction. This is Indian magazine. And just now we uh, select some material for another published and maybe uh, Dr. Barry will uh, recommend me some doctor who can help me. I like this uh, picture. Antonio Stradivari, violin, Paola Paganini, Nicola Paganini, sorry, and without hand of uh, musician, this is only piece of wood. Without hand of treatment, this is only piece of metal. Our magic music in our hand. Nicola Paganini, 10, 15 hours daily, make some exercise with violin. And Elizara uh, frame only in the hand of doctor who each day use this frame can help us with magic orthopedic music. For me, this is my father, my teacher, my life, my home. Just now, one planet in the sky has name of Elizarov. And with you, we can more than each us can alone. I invite you for collaboration for cooperation and exchange of our experience. Thank you very much, doctor. And if you have interest, we need continued our meeting. Thank you very much. Namaste. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you. sir. Thank you for your uh, fantastic presentation. Uh, now, I would like to uh, request uh, Professor Mopakharul Barista to uh, share his uh, experience uh, regarding the uh, cosmetic purpose of Elizaro. Uh, uh, Professor Mopakharul Barista, would you please uh, share your experience uh, in the perspective of Bangladesh? Uh, so please uh, first unmute yourself. You have to unmute yourself. I think uh, I think you have unmuted yourself.
Doctor Bare. Yes. Do you hear me? Y yes. Thank you very much. You, uh, you, you have shown a lot of cases and very interesting. I enjoyed your lecture. Thank you. Na uh, you are in the show. Now I am, I am trying to show you something just to add with you. Okay. Oh, yo, 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 yo. One minute. Yes, screen share. Yes, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. can you see? See, no, uh, no, sir, not yet, uh, not yet, not yet. One minute, one minute, give me a few seconds. And uh, this is for just a uh, very easy procedure, but very, very difficult procedure. And if some doctor won't uh, touch cosmetic patient, please remember about uh, Ukrainian patient. Ukrainian patient lost life. I have few patients with very difficult result, very bad result. And uh, only experience we have touch uh, Professor Navikov, sir, is there any uh, chance of uh, common peroneal nerve injury during the time of lengthening? Second, uh, second time of uh, distraction, uh, few patients we have with big amount of lengthening, with uh, double level of lengthening, we have. This reason no. why uh, I recommend only one level. And uh, when we have some gap, we immediately decrease speed of lengthening with this propose, like you say, for... Uh, Neurological problem. One millimeter per day, usually patient cannot tolerate all period of lengthening. Two, three weeks, then we decrease speed of lengthening. Okay. Can you see my screen now? No, sir. Uh, we cannot see Not our yet. screen, sir. No, sir. Dr. Barry, I have same yes. situation. <laughs> 15 minutes, I cannot show. Because this is Friday, Juma Namaz. Juma Namaz. Juma Namaz. Now you will be able to see. Yes, sir. We also start waiting for your slide. Yes, yes. Now I'm showing you. One minute. Juma Namaz Friday. Yes. Novikov rightly say. You want now? Oh. <laughs> so, uh, can we distract the uh, yeah. cosmetic bone? Uh, in the same manner as like as we do in case of a uh, uh, traumatic case Tra traumatic case yeah, i'm not uh, i not follow your uh, question you, you just uh, please, uh, please repeat Nadia, again is, uh, yes sir you just told us that uh, 1 millimeter uh, uh, distraction uh, after uh, 2 weeks or 3 weeks uh, you just uh, slow the process uh, yeah. Then uh, you will do uh, less than one millimeter. Uh, you, you told us 
uh, in your previous lecture that uh, you will make a wave like this. Uh, uh, sometimes it increases, yeah, sometimes yeah. it decreases, sometimes it increases, sometimes it decreases. Uh, can we follow this? This is the pain of the... Now, now, can you see? Yeah. Uh, no, sir. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Why? I am seeing sir, a full sir, screen. I, yes. Yes, sir. We can. Yes, sir. You can? Yeah, yeah. Now? Just, just now we can, we can see. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Now I'm going. Uh, I, I I want to talk uh, within a very short time. Cosmetic dream and stretch and lengthening procedure by my lovely Lizard of Technique, dear friends, uh, especially Tanvir. Professor Novikov and Dr. Shamsul Huda. I want to share my little experience with you. These are, you see, you can see the Kiev, my MS, during my MS in Kiev, Ukraine, in Uzbekistan, Tashkent, and my lovely institute, Kurgan, my lovely institute, our trauma center at orthopedic in Dhaka, my working place, my private place. These are the Elizar, you can see here. 4M and stature lengthening a large, larger set of population with short stature are very unhappy about their height. They are not satisfied with the shape or proportion of their legs. May their height causes their psychological discomfort or some other reason makes them feel incomplete as a person. Patient with psychological state of short stature, dysphoria, seems to feel very odd there regarding their height. Some patients after adolescence do not feel that they have fully grown. In young people with stature shorter than average always feels themselves with anxiety and tension. Perhaps the limb lengthening surgery services may give a good solution. The decision to alter your legs for aesthetic reason, that is the correction of the legs or limb lengthening is a serious one. What is limb lengthening? By a small incision, the bone is cut and a laser device is applied on limb. The device gradually pull apart the fragments from each other leading to new bone. That is, we call it callus formation. Bone and soft tissues can grow under mechanical tension, which is very close to the natural growth and which depends on the law of tension and stress of the laser. Dear friends, we are happy that in my country, we are doing a regular basis limb lengthening surgery. And in our practice, we increased the height by 27 centimeters for cosmetic reasons. This was indicated because of obvious disproportion between the patient's body and arms and legs. Professor Elizarov invented method destruction of osteogenesis and passed scientifically that tissues can grow under law of tension. Under tension, that is Elizarov's law that I told you earlier. And today, Elizarov link lengthening method is a well known old word, is used to solve many orthopedic and trauma problems. Growing taller is similar to the Elizarov's recursive surgery, but there are certain technical and psychological differences. Different medical centers in different countries perform stretcher lengthening. And we have treated patients from different corners of the Bangladesh and other countries, Myanmar, Japan, and India as well. Our success rate, inshallah, is very high. Our reputation is worldwide known. We strictly follow the Kurgan teaching, the Elizar ring fixator for gradual distraction as well as consolidation. The main advantage that corticotomy can be done in the metaphysis of tibia. The usual goal for lengthening for a stature for most patients with the Lizarro fixator is 2 to 3.5 inches. Our preference for tibia lengthening over femoral lengthening is because of several good reasons. Tibia lengthening makes one leg look longer than femoral lengthening. The reason for this is that the level of knees and the feet are obvious, but the level of the hips is not obvious. Technically, it can be performed in one operation in a reasonable period of time. There is much less blood loss in tibial lengthening. It is much easier and better tolerated to have two Elizabeth ring fixator on both the legs than on both eyes. Now, we shall have to ask some 10 questions regarding the limb lengthening. What is the limb lengthening? Is limb lengthening surgery painful? Is it possible to become taller by using tablets or exercises? 
which is the best available method for high degrees, how much is the cost, and which part of the legs can be lengthened, how much is it possible to increase height, and how long does it take, is it dangerous, why does leg lengthening seems to be more common in developing countries, what is the physical activity of the patient after the surgery, in process of lengthening and after the treatment. Now let us see some case illustrations. This girl came to me at the age of 23 years. His height, her height was five feet, you can see. And she insisted me to go for lengthening. I told her, your, your height is five feet, it's okay for my country. No, he told me, doc, she told me, doctor, I want to increase my height and I want to be more beautiful. And she was really a beautiful girl. And I started, before starting surgery, I counsel him, talk, talk to this lady, young girl, and just explain everything regarding the limb lengthening process. Now, sequentially, you can see from left to right side, and a beautiful girl, and this is, I was talking about lengthening, you can see the two rings, and you can see here two, upper two, and telescopic grass, and now you can see four inches, this is too much I have done. Because this is not advisable, but patient is happy. Patient is happy. And this is, you see, 18 years old girl, five feet again, came to me, university student. And I started doing lengthening. You can see, after two months, two months, and you can see, after four months, he could walk. What Professor Novikov told, you should have to see the 90 degree of the uh, ankle, that is plantigrade position. If you have equinus, then it is very dangerous. When you are going for lengthening, you should have to see the equinus of the uh, foot. Now, she is without any hesitation. She could walk with the help of this. This is the lengthening. She, she, she is a university student. And with this apparatus, she was going to the Dhaka University in the management department. Now you can see dear friends, the ankle is okay, leg is okay, and very easily she is walking, she is stepping very nicely. And this is during the treatment, sequential stage. You can see a little bit callus formation from side, disturbing. Now it is okay, six months. And this is five feet, four inches, lengthening of the same girl. And this is the girl. She's starting in UK. Uh, she wanted to do for lengthening in UK. That's very costly. Can you imagine? They take six centimeters near about 80 to 90 lakhs taka. My, my Bangladesh taka. It's too much. Then came to my place. Now she is in England. And I have started lengthening. You can see during treatment the desire of apparatus. This is the sequential and at the same time she is doing exercises in my room now see exercise is very important fundamental principle of elizar methodology is load and motion load plus motion it gives healing now you can see how she is walking with the elizar apparatus in both the legs so this is uh, i'm taking mother of the uh, daughter, mother of the uh, that young girl, and uh, you can see, now after removal, uh, I have increased 6 centimeter, 2.2, this is enough for, uh, for her, with this she can use a little bit, uh, you know, heel, that is, she is taller, she is very happy, uh, this is, she is very, very happy. Now you can see here, this is, this is the final. She was 4 feet, 8 inches, 5 feet. This is a doctor from another district. Then I lengthened her. You can see in the left side. And this is the clinical follow-up. After 2 months, 2 inches lengthening was done. And at the same time, I always allow my patient to go for exercises. Look at the ankle and foot. 
when you are going for lengthening, you may invite equitus. To overcome that, you should have to continue the exercises. So this is the, uh, uh, you can see uh, the consolidation, callus formation. And this is, height is increased, how much? And this is, this is also, uh, she, she was starting in UK, came to my place. The, they are taking too much, too much money. Then I started lengthening, you can see. When she was a little bit non-cooperative, and that's why a little bit problem with the equinus. And initially, it was that. And then finally, uh, we overcome that one. So this is the uh, C after uh, total height increase. So pain is a crisis process inside the mind. In lengthening process, patient surgeon interaction is very important. You should have to talk with the patient before going for surgery. A cosmetic lengthening is an access to a human understanding and the dream of the patient physically and mentally. Success comes from hard work and meticulous follow up of the uh, uh, doctor at the same time from the patient's side also. The lizard frame is strong enough and can work with full white beard. And this is also published my uh, published in 2017 in uh, American uh, Medical Journal. And I always love to show this one. And I always do, I always deal with the uh, three. If you if you think about the easy, difficult, and impossible, you should have to go ahead with the difficult cases. And this is the how we can get peace when you are dealing cosmetic. Lengthening is not a very easy thing, you can see. You should have to fight with the Elizaro apparatus for achieving good result. If you increase the patient, it gives a precious leg or patient, if you increase the height, it gives him or her a satisfactory result throughout the whole life. And this is my center, Elizaro. Okay. And this is books and my all good friends from Kurgan, you can see with our uh, most senior surgeon, Professor Shamsuddin Sar and other Kurgan fellows. Uh, these are the uh, other fellows. And I'm always grateful to Professor Elizar, Professor Shepsov, Novikov, Gubin, other friends for our cooperation all the time. So thank you so much, dear friends. Thank you for giving me the chance to talk on Cosmetic Dream. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you for your magnificent presentation uh, regarding the uh, uh, cosmetic lengthening uh, in the perspective of Bangladesh. Uh, we don't have any more time as because of uh, uh, we have two presentations today. I uh, hope we'll uh, discuss it uh, in the next uh, session, in the coming Friday. Uh, dear viewers, uh, uh, today we want to end up with this uh, uh, presentation. Uh, uh, can I ask uh, a one question? more question? Yeah, yeah, please. One last question, please. Yeah, thank you, sir. Thank you, uh, Baris sir, Navikov sir, for our wonderful talk, sir. I'll just ask a short question. In India, we are having uh, medical legal issues regarding cosmetic lending besides diseases. What is the medical legal aspect there in Bangladesh and Kurgan? Because we have, we cannot uh, do on an average patient. Patient having a, a psychological stress is very important because lengthening and giving another complication is very bad. We have got so many cases of shoes in cases. What is the views of the medical legal aspects for cosmetic limb lending, sir? We don't have any uh, rules and regulations for medical legal aspects in my country. And if patient wishes is surgeon experience, we can do that. But in India, I know the one surgeon they started doing, and there is a complication for that. It, is, is, is arises yes i know that one it's okay some countries they don't allow but in russia in my country we can go for lengthening in cosmetic what about um, Noviko? Noviko, Noviko, sir. Uh, Noviko, sir. Please sir, you have to uh Noviko, sir you have to unmute uh, yourself sir. Noviko, sir, please unmute yourself Because here in India, we have maximum we are doing with the diseases like polio, echinoplasia only. Mm -hmm. 
And uh, just now, you heard me. Yes, sir. We yes, can hear you, sir. Sir, any uh, and, uh, about, about the medical legal issues, sir? Any? If, uh, colleagues, colleagues, if patient has disproportional, doesn't matter which uh, his height, for example, two meters, and his win, two meters, 10 centimeters, we need support them. If some patient has 150, but this is patient inside of gold section, no touch them, because each hour centimeters will go away from disproportional. For me, with my age, with my experience, I will touch only patient, not patient, healthy person who has medical reason. I calculate, I measure if uh, this some reason, not only money reason, <clears throat> I will touch, I will help. And remember, this is any surgery. We cannot, we cannot back. If just now I will broken, this is will never like before. When we touch healthy person and when we broken bone, will never like before. And before surgery, we give few days for thinking. We open all our cut. We uh, explain all of our experience, difficulties, including problems. And when we talk about complications, why I do this? Uh, my amount of lengthening because three five centimeters possible just now if I want increase space between my hand I will damage this soft tissue after my experience after five six centimeters all time doctor has problem and complications what patient want he wants centimeters with complication i know what i am want to be master and if i know with this amount i will have complications i will never go because this is my name with uh, <clears throat> my age I want finished only with excellent and good result. Sorry, small amount of lengthening. Sorry, only with medical reason. Doesn't matter how many money patient won't pay. One one very short other because, questions are. Uh, many... um, yeah, yeah, I listen. Uh, thank you. Yes, sir. Uh, okay. sir, what is your view about uh, lengthening of a nail? We, many of us are doing lengthening of a nail in India and in the US we have uh, precise nails. What are your views about that, sir? Lengthening of a nail. And the nail, uh, we have only one patient. Three years we treat complications. After that, and bone mirror for me, holy cow. I no one touch. Bone mirror. I know one disturb. I know one damage bone mirror. And for what? And you see, why doctor remove external fixator? Because uh, all of uh, orthopedics uh, talk about time of osteosynthesis. For yeah. how many months you put nail? Sometimes one year, sometimes two years. This is period of osteosynthesis, very dangerous period. I know want that because my father uh, says, bone mirror, this is mother. Mother is mother everywhere. If doctor prepare, and one more. Uh, when uh, I treat with external fixator, this is my, this is my duty. I won't spend time. I want to, to be near the doctor and this is depend of doctor, I think. If a doctor has uh, enough experience, if uh, everything is good, why not? But for me, I will never 
use this technique. Thank, thank you, you thank you very much, sir. Uh, okay. Thank you, Dr. Shamsuluda, for asking you nice questions, and thank you, Professor Navigam, sir, for uh, sharing your experience with us. Uh, uh, dear viewers, uh, at us, uh, we came to know that that uh, we can do the uh, cosmetic lengthening by the magical Eliza But uh, first, we have to discuss these things, the complications uh, with our patients. Uh, and we have to uh, take care of the uh, medical legal importance, uh, definitely. If there is any uh, rules and regulations in your country, uh, then you have to follow your rules and regulations. But uh, we can do many things by the Elizaro, like the cosmetic lengthening also. Uh, so hope uh, we'll see you in the next Friday with uh, another topic. Uh, till then, I'm Dr. Mahmoud Tarnir Ashraf. I want to say bye-bye from Orthopedic Commission Academy to you. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you. You are watching Raj TV. Jagorone, Bangladesh. Please subscribe our 